The UK Biobank is an amazing resource of almost half a million people, which captures all kinds of information about uh, what diseases they have, their health records, what drugs they've been on, and all kinds of information that they themselves have provided, as well as the whole genome data that looks at all of the letters of DNA in our cells, not just the letters that are in our genes. So we have about 20,000 genes, but they only occupy about 2% of all of the DNA that's in our cells. We know that the rest of that DNA often is controlling which genes are switched on and off in which tissues, and we know that that can be important in disease. But without whole genome data that looks at all of the letters of DNA, we don't have the ability to explore how important variation in those non-coding regions is for health and disease. And now, for the first time, we have an opportunity to explore it in a comprehensive way in hundreds of thousands of patients across all kinds of different diseases. When we think about whole genome data, what we're talking about there is taking an individual's genetic material and decoding it and digitizing it. Every time a participant signed up, they gave a blood sample that was processed by UK Biobank colleagues. And the DNA was sent to the Sanger Institute as well as Decode Genetics because we delivered the sequencing in partnership. And once the samples are ready, they're loaded in liquid form onto large scale instruments, which then run automatically to read each base of the DNA many millions of times. And at the peak of the main phase, there were in the region of 20,000 human genomes being sequenced per month between Sanger and Decode. And there are very few organizations around the world that are geared up to be able to generate data on such a large scale. And we were really delighted at the Sanger to be able to contribute in the way that we have done. The scale of the project was at another level compared to what had been considered before, but that allowed us really to use the expertise that had delivered so many great projects at Sanger before, and then think, how can we just scale those using all the great knowledge and expertise that we have at the Institute? I think everybody thought, yes, we should be able to do it from the sequencing side, but it goes beyond that. When you look at the size of the data set and the ambition and what the partners have done, it really is something to generate such a valuable data set for the global research community. There were a large number of people and teams that were involved in helping to plan as well as to deliver this major project. But I'd really like to recognise and thank each of the participants at UK Biobank who've generously donated their samples and their medical information, without which none of this incredible project could have succeeded. So for Sanger, we're immensely proud to be part of this. This is the world's biggest genetic data set. And our mission is not just to do our own science, but also to empower the science of the entire community by providing data resources like the UK Biobank whole genome sequencing, which will be transformative for thousands of researchers and ultimately for, for hundreds of thousands of patients.